Stan, I'm about to lay some hard, earth-shattering truth on you. You should probably lie down. Things are about to get crazy real for you. I'll light some candles and put on some Enya. Wait, Jeff, don't eat that egg! I just read a shocking expose in the Langley Alt Weekly about Gentle Goodness Valley, our brand of supposedly cruelty-free eggs. Apparently, they're not all there cracked up to be. <laughs> Turns out they've been punching the chickens left and right, just like at the big corporate farms. Well, who's so high and mighty now? Ready to switch to my brand? Never! Hey, some people keep chickens in their backyard and get their eggs that way. Jeff and I could do that. Ha! Huh, you bozos! That'll be the day. Yes, Mom. That'll be the day. Silence! The time draws near for the... Mail! Yes, the mail. With each letter, the promise of a thrilling new adventure. Let's see. Inherited a haunted amusement park. SOS from Mine Quad. Yeah, these are all big-time duds. Maybe I'll check my email. My answer is a harsh and emphatic no. I have every confidence I'll knock his socks off all on my own at this b -b 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 barbecue summer casual. <laughs> it sucks. It blows. I look like an idiot. A fool. It's terrible. Hated it. Stupid. Get it out of here, Francine. Uh, yes, baller as hell. Done. <laughs> it makes my shoulders look weird. Like a monster's shoulders! For the love of God, how the hell am I ever supposed to do any work in this house? Ugh! Dooper! Hooper! What's shaking? My babies? Geez, Stan, isn't it a little hot for... Is this corduroy? Raw meat. So... Cold feels good. Smith? Are you all right? Hey! And then Duper said, Oh my God, look at his fupa! I made a fool of myself! And the worst part is Gooper's having another barbecue this Saturday! You work with a Gooper? Yeah, he sits over by the printer with Hooper, Booper, and Ozymandias. You need to find true, easy confidence, but the suit won't let you. Whoa. This isn't really Enya, by the way, it's just Enya-like. Whoa. Guilty as charged. I ask absolutely nothing in return. I'll just have to dust off my old fashion designer persona. <sighs> ah, no dust. Hold on a sec. <sighs> Sir Jennings Cockburn, fashion titan of post-war London. <laughs> Don't breathe that in, Stan, it's asbestos. <laughs> and how do you feel? Lighter than air. Now run along, my goose. <laughs> <sighs> ah! <laughs> my watermelon! Surprise. Ah! Looks like us bozos might see this thing through after all. So where'd you bozos get all these chickens anyway? Dicks with chicks. The local chicken hatchery owned by brothers Larry and Randall Dick. And how many eggs have you gotten? None yet. The chickens turned out to be a bit more uh, aggressive than expected. But we're making great progress with the little ladies. The trick is to never show them any fear. <laughs> ah, devil bird! Ah! <laughs> well, they're crapping all over the place, so you can't keep them in the yard. Ready to give up yet? Yes! Free! Yo, Stan, where you want this puppy? Me and the guys had such a good time, we decided to keep it going with a little after barbecue. To the backyard, boys! Stand! Stand! <laughs> nice work. Wait, there was something special I was going to do if I had a good time today. A celebratory cannonball! Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Instant promotion! <laughs> Where's my boot? Oh, you get your boop, my lady. Roger? Is that you, my goose? I do you an unsolicited favor, asking for nothing in return, and this is how you return the favor! 
You are a bad friend. If it helps, it's your clothes that have given me this new lease on life. My relationships have improved, I'm pooping people like crazy, and my knees have never looked better. Anytime you need me, just call and I'll be there. I promise. <laughs> intercom system installed so you can hear me moan more easily. Ah! you just give up and admit you couldn't pull it off? The only thing I am admitting is an omelet into my mouth and stomach this time next Tuesday. Fine. But why don't you go sleep in Jeff's van till then? Chicken's got the van. Should we pull him over? What is it with you and chickens? Chicken killed my parents. Me too. But I don't let it rule my life, man. So, how do you come up with the designs? <sighs> Let's see, I think of the idea for the clothes, then I make the clothes, and then the clothes are done. Do we have a waitress, or...? What is your problem? These guys all suck, Stan. Let's get out of here, get back to just you and me. For a swamp monster! From Planet Ugly, it's a disaster! Smith, are you okay? I'm sure as f doing better than you, you ugly old piece of shit. Ha <laughs> That ribbing wasn't good natured. Here comes the boop. Stan, what's going on? Oh, uh, easy breezy fun. Tickle time. Ow, Stan, stop, please. You're hurting. <laughs> Ow! Ah, fetus. Well, I guess it's going to happen every once in a while. Fetus. Fetus, fetus, two fetuses, fetus, snake, fetus. Uh oh. It's omelet time. Mmm. Now that's what I call. <laughs> Don't even like it! Wrong, Klaus. I lied to Stan. I do know how to make clothes. But I wanted him to feel easy and free in anything he wears. So, who's the bad friend now? I lied to Klaus, Martha. As you well know, I do not know how to make clothes. I lied to Martha, Steve. I actually do know how to make clothes. Okay. Do you or do you not know how to make clothes? I don't know. I don't know. I, I guess I'm just feeling a bit more comfortable in my own skin. Bye-bye, see you soon. Who is this? Night Ranger, man. Night Ranger? <laughs> I just want to say for the <laughs>